the other thing that happened, though, finally, is that he did give his speech at the UN. And I thought it was significant that um, he actually spoke out at the UN against isolationism, isolationism in his own country. So clearly, I think he's worried after the problem of getting support for uh, an attack on Syria that there's something brewing here in our country that's not helpful to any president on the international front. Right. He essentially kind of laid out a little bit of a roadmap of, of his focus for the rest of his second term and said, you know what, we're, we're going to focus on the Middle East and we're going to engage. And, and he laid out uh, peace in the Middle East, Israeli-Palestinian peace, and uh, dealing with Iran's nuclear program as priorities. And, and so he made clear that he's not going to back off and, and disengage on that front. What happened to the pivot to Asia? <laughs> That's what Asia. Asia's asking yeah, also. Right. Yeah. Well, you know, uh, the, uh, as a former resident of the Middle East, the Middle East always rises up and <laughs> vanquishes those who want to ignore it. It doesn't happen.